Well, it is the first day of preschool for Des Moines Public Schools, and this year the district is making some changes to accommodate a growing need for preschool education. District leaders tell Local 5's Megan McPherson they want to break down the barriers keeping kids out of the classroom. The youngest learners of Des Moines Public Schools were welcomed here at the Jesse Taylor Franklin Education Center in Des Moines earlier this morning as the start of a new year of preschool began. Plenty of excitement as this year DMPS officials are implementing some changes to address some of the barriers faced by students and their families. The district is adding two classrooms offering free all day preschool to four year olds. There were six of those city funded classes last year that served 120 students with the total now up to eight 160 preschoolers will get to attend for free this year. In addition to eliminating financial barriers, the district wants to do the same on the transportation front. That's a huge barrier for families trying to get their child to and from preschool. One of the things that people I think just don't realize is that districts don't get funding for preschool transportation. And so um, I feel really fortunate that our board and superintendent um, have invested. If a preschool student lives within the school's boundary, but more than a mile and a half away, a new pilot school bus program will offer a ride to those students in nine school locations. All of the spots in the free full day DMPS preschool classrooms have been filled, but district leaders do tell me that there are still some spots available in some of those half day classrooms. In Des Moines, Megan McPherson, Local 5 News.